Listen, man, I'm just going to cut to the chase. Um, okay, so... Um, all right. So, there's been a link or whatever have you that, you know, the Broncos are going to be facing the New York Giants, right? Um... We lead the series seven to six, right? Including the playoffs and the regular season and the Super Bowl twenty one. We all know how that panned out. Right? Now for me, there's been a lot of Giants fans that, you know, see this game and thinking that oh, there's no way we can lose, right? Like there's no way the Broncos can beat us. The Broncos and the Giants go way back. We have history. We may not have history like, you know, the teams in our division, like the Eagles, the Cowboys, and the Washington team. But the the, the Broncos, we have some, you know, we have history, you know. Um, and I just think that, um, you know, playing at home, um, the Giants never do well at home for some odd reason. They always like playing better on the road. They play better on the road than they do at home. Um, I don't know why, but it's just, uh, uh, it's just, uh, a, a, a stigma about them. You know, it's just a aura about them. Like they just playing, they just like playing to the crowds and not for the crowds. You know what I'm saying? Um, they get a better knack of playing on the road than they do at home. You know, if you look at our home record last year, it stunk. It stunk. I think we only won one at... I can't even front with you. Um, I know we beat the... Uh, we beat the Cowboys. No, we beat the Redskins away. We beat the Eagles at home. Um, we lost to the Buccaneers at home. So... The Giants have a lot of losses at home last year, but they did pretty good on the road. Um, so I just think that, um, you know, people might say X's and O's and this and that. Like, right now, we can't really predict who's going to win. I mean, I can because I know my team from the back for, for like a handbook, you know. I know we're going to lose week one. There's no question about it. Uh, the Bron, like, and that's the thing about statistical stats and stuff like that. Like, yeah, the 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 the, the Giants might clean the 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 Broncos sweep clean off. You know, the Giants might be better than them on defense. The Giants might be better ten times better than them on offense. Play calling might probably go to the Broncos. Special teams might probably go to the Giants. Like. Any statistical stat you can think of, the Giants might probably get away with it or run away with it, right? But at the end of the day, the Broncos will wind up winning this game. Two reasons why. Von Miller. There's nobody kind of, There's nobody on God... Uh, I'm not going to say God, but there's nobody on the Giants that can control this guy. Like, I'm pretty sure I really wanted the Giants to draft them, but obviously we was not in that position to draft them. But Von Miller is still Von Miller when he's 100% healthy and right. You know what I'm saying? Um, this guy is just a wreak of havoc. And people and Giants fans tend to forget who the Broncos have. The Broncos still have a very good defense, you know? Uh, even though their record indicated that, you know, they were poorly coached, they pretty they they held their own on they held their own on offense. No, they held their own on defense pretty good. You know? Um now there's there's a lot of speculations that, you know, um there's a lot of speculations that, you know, the Broncos is trying to, you know, reach reach out to Aaron Rodgers agent. You know what I'm saying? Kind of like how Denver Broncos, you saw how Peyton Manning left Indy, went to the Broncos, and obviously won the championship. Now, obviously, I'm not saying that it's going to happen to Aaron Rodgers, but 
Looking at the Denver Broncos quarterback, I don't trust neither of them, to be honest with you. You know, if Denver wants to win a Super Bowl or win a Super Bowl in the next two years or three years, I would say make the move. I would say make the move, you know what I'm saying? Because right now, none of your quarterbacks are good enough to face the Giants if they were to face the Giants at home, you know, or when they face the Giants at home, you know what I'm saying? I just think that with Aaron Rodgers, the defense will start playing better because I don't believe in Andrew Luck. I mean, not Andrew Luck. I don't believe in, in, in Luck or Teddy Bridgewater. Now, they can win you playoff games, no doubt about it. You know, they can, not playoff games, they can win you um, regular season games. But when it comes to playoffs, uh, it's a long stretch. But for for right now, I just don't, I just don't see, I just don't see, um, I just don't see the Giants beating the Broncos if they get Aaron Rodgers before, you know, um, the start of, uh, or the end of preseason, you know. Um, but I believe they will pull the trigger. I do believe the Broncos will get Aaron Rodgers. Um, but yeah, but like I said, like, comment, subscribe. Till next time, take care of yourself and each other.